For the first time in human history we are looking at the face of a planet outside our own solar system. NASA has just released a direct, high-resolution image of Proxima b, an exoplanet orbiting the star closest to our Sun. This is not an artist's rendering or a computer model, it's a real photograph, a genuine portrait of a world 4.2 light-years away. This achievement marks a monumental turning point in astronomy and our quest to understand the cosmos. For decades, exoplanets were only detected indirectly, as data points on a graph. Now that has changed. The ability to capture a direct image of a planet like Proxima b is a testament to incredible technological advancement. It required pushing the limits of optics, data processing, and space-based observation. This image is more than a curiosity. It's a new tool for scientific inquiry, allowing us to ask questions that were once science fiction. We can now begin to map the surface of another terrestrial world, look for signs of an atmosphere, and search for chemical signatures that might indicate habitability. We are moving from simply counting exoplanets to understanding what those worlds are actually like. The release of this image resonates with our fundamental desire to explore and know our place in the universe. While this single picture cannot answer the ultimate questions, are there other Earths? Are we alone? It brings us a giant leap closer. This image is an invitation to dream bigger and to push further into the cosmic ocean. An exoplanet is simply a planet that orbits a star outside our solar system. Since the early 1990s, we've discovered thousands, ranging from massive gas giants to small rocky worlds like Earth. These discoveries have revealed an astonishing diversity of planetary systems, fundamentally changing our understanding of how solar systems form and evolve. Proxima b, discovered in 2016, is our closest known exoplanetary neighbor, orbiting the red dwarf Proxima Centauri. It's a rocky planet about 1.3 times the mass of Earth, and its proximity makes it a prime target for study. Proxima b orbits its star at a distance much closer than Mercury orbits our Sun, completing a year in just 11.2 Earth days. Because Proxima Centauri is a faint red dwarf, this close orbit places Proxima b within the star's habitable zone, where liquid water could exist. However, red dwarfs are volatile, emitting powerful flares that could strip away a planet's atmosphere and bathe its surface in radiation. Proxima b is likely tidally locked, with one side always facing the star and the other in perpetual darkness. This would create extreme temperature differences between the two hemispheres. The search for life on Proxima b is complicated by these challenges, but its location in the habitable zone keeps it at the forefront of exploration. It remains our cosmic next-door neighbor, waiting to be studied. Capturing a direct image of an exoplanet is one of astronomy's greatest challenges. Exoplanets are incredibly faint, lost in the glare of their host stars, like spotting a firefly next to a searchlight. NASA overcame this with the James Webb Space Telescope, equipped with a coronagraph, a high-tech mask that blocks starlight, revealing faint planets nearby. The JWST's large mirror and space location provide the sensitivity needed for this delicate task. Hundreds of hours of observation and advanced computer algorithms were used to process the data, separating the planet's faint signal from the star's glare. By combining and analyzing these images, scientists subtracted the starlight with unprecedented precision finally revealing Proxima b. The telescope's mirrors can be adjusted in real time to maintain perfect focus and stability crucial for resolving such a tiny object. This achievement is a triumph of engineering and scientific perseverance. The combination of JWST's power, its advanced coronagraph and sophisticated image processing techniques made this historic photograph possible. It's a new era for exoplanet imaging. For the first time, we can see a neighboring world as it truly is. Proxima b is about 4.2 light years away, nearly 25 trillion miles. Even our fastest spacecraft would take tens of thousands of years to reach it. This immense gulf of space highlights why direct imaging is such a remarkable feat. For comparison, the Moon is just three days away, Mars takes months, and Pluto is billions of miles from Earth. Yet Proxima b is over 7,000 times farther than Pluto. Proxima b is a super-Earth about 1.3 times Earth's mass, likely rocky but orbiting a very different kind of star. Proxima Centauri is a red dwarf, much cooler and dimmer than our Sun so its habitable zone is much closer in. The planet's short, 11-day year and likely tidal lock state create conditions utterly alien to our solar system. Imagine a world where the Sun hangs motionless in the sky, a dim red orb. One hemisphere is locked in perpetual daylight, the other in endless night. The twilight ring between these extremes, the Terminator Zone, might offer the most stable temperatures. 
Understanding these exotic conditions is a key goal of studying the new image. It's a stark reminder of how different other worlds can be. The high-resolution image from JWST gives us our first direct look at Proxima B's surface features. While not a detailed map, it reveals large-scale variations in brightness and color across the visible hemisphere. Scientists see a brighter region near the center of the day side, possibly a vast ice cap, a high plateau, or thick cloud cover. If Proxima B has an atmosphere, clouds could help distribute heat and shield the surface from radiation. Darker areas may be volcanic rock fields or scorched desert, hinting at a dynamic, geologically active world. The contrast between bright and dark regions suggests Proxima B is not uniform, but shaped by complex processes. By analyzing light at different wavelengths, scientists can search for clues about its composition, like silicate rocks or water ice. The data is still being analyzed for signs of an atmosphere or chemical signatures. Each new detail brings us closer to understanding this neighboring world. The new image and existing data help us build a clearer picture of Proxima B's climate. Its tidal-locked state creates a stark thermal divide, a scorching day side and a frozen night side. The terminator zone, the band of perpetual twilight, could be the only region with moderate temperatures and potential for liquid water. Powerful winds would likely sweep across the planet, redistributing heat if an atmosphere exists. Proxima Centauri's violent flares pose a major challenge. A strong atmosphere and magnetic field would be needed to protect any surface life. Whether Proxima B has an atmosphere remains a critical, unanswered question. JWST can search for atmospheric gases by analyzing starlight passing through the planet's atmosphere. Even if the current image doesn't confirm an atmosphere, future observations will focus on this search. The presence or absence of an atmosphere will determine if Proxima B is a barren rock or a potentially dynamic world. The image of Proxima B is a milestone in NASA's ongoing search for exoplanets. Missions like TESS scan the sky for exoplanets using the transit method, while JWST follows up with detailed characterization. JWST's spectroscopic instruments can analyze exoplanet atmospheres, searching for biosignatures like oxygen, methane, and water vapor. Ground-based telescopes use adaptive optics and the radial velocity method to find planets that don't transit their stars. The synergy between ground and space telescopes provides a fuller picture of these distant worlds. Each discovery brings us closer to answering the age-old question, are we alone? While JWST leads exoplanet research today, NASA is planning the next generation of observatories. The upcoming Nancy Grace Roman Space Telescope will survey the galaxy with a field of view a hundred times wider than Hubble, using gravitational microlensing and advanced coronagraphs. Looking further ahead, the proposed Habitable Worlds Observatory aims to directly image Earth-like planets around nearby stars and analyze their atmospheres for biosignatures. Achieving this will require even larger mirrors and more advanced starlight suppression systems, possibly even starshades. These missions could transform exoplanet science from studying planetary properties to searching for alien biospheres. Within decades, we may not only see other rocky worlds but also know if their skies have clouds, their surfaces have oceans, and their atmospheres hold signs of life. The image of Proxima b is just the beginning. The high-resolution image of Proxima b moves it from a data point to a visible world. We've crossed from inference to observation, opening a new era of exploration. The image hints at a complex alien environment, tidally locked with bright and dark regions shaped by its red dwarf star. This accomplishment is a testament to decades of technological progress and scientific ingenuity. It's a powerful reminder of the vastness and diversity of the cosmos, fueling our imagination and curiosity. As we refine our tools and gaze deeper into space we edge closer to answering, will we find life elsewhere, or is Earth unique? The journey has just begun.